in geography last year there was a good number of questions around 21 22 questions were there in environment around 15 questions were there so together it covers nearly uh, you know 35 questions out of 100 and based on the last 2 3 years of trend so geography uh, my production is more on the physical geography side okay so particularly uh, if i have to mention few of the important topics so uh, it should cover uh, the plate tectonics earthquakes volcanism and uh, even the geomagnetism recent uh, uh, you know incidents of uh, geomagnetic storms aurora and uh, talking about the climatology it's mainly about the temperature and pressure distribution okay so we have to study that uh, the pattern of distribution and the uh, winds and uh, rainfall particularly talking about uh, the thunderstorms cloud burst tornadoes and uh, other than that uh, the cyclones tropical cyclones and climatic regions okay so uh, then that uh, el nino la nina ocean currents and uh, talking about the indian physical aspects it's mainly focused upon mapping okay so uh, main part of uh, the physical aspects to be covered thoroughly through mapping what is given in 11th standard ncert that is sufficient here and uh, in addition to some aspects of economic geography related to you know current related aspects the distribution of minerals etc so talking about environment uh, the focus should be more about the uh, recent initiatives related to climate change and uh, biodiversity conservation and as well as some of the the environmental laws which are recently amended and uh, some basic aspects uh, related to ecology biodiversity some background uh, study so this should be sufficient